So this happened. Ladies and gentlemen, we are back yet again because we have a new Sonic Frontiers trailer out now. I wake up this morning and I go online and I see this thing staring back at me. By the thumbnail, this already is going to be really good already. I was not expecting this today. Like, I literally just get done with the Frontiers, my thoughts so far, in death video, which you should go check out. I get done with it and we get so much more news. Like, come on. Like, this is why I don't intend to ever make one of those ever again, probably. And also, I hated the way I made it. But, uh, made it? What? I also hate the way I made it. Go check that out if you want to see my full, uh, in-depth thoughts on Sonic Frontier so far. Again, it's before all this stuff came out. Like, the music dropping, which is fantastic. Fantastic. And also there is also the um, <laughs> I forgot what else the more big the cat footage and other stuff as well That I had to edit in and the music drops which are amazing So yeah again, I'm never gonna make these my thoughts so far Ever again on a game because they're just gonna keep dropping stuff but Yeah, you know today's actually a pretty interesting day that they dropped this trailer because we've gotten a lot of stuff Like yesterday we had the Nintendo Direct and PlayStation State of Play which I apologize I did not stream them because I had class yesterday. At the time it was yesterday, it was right when the direct was happening. I was in class when it happened, so by the time I got out of class, it was over. And the state of play, I had dinner plans yesterday, so I couldn't stream that either, so I'm sorry. I mean, why would I want to stream a Nintendo Farm Direct anyways, so yeah. Except State of Play, that was awesome. That new God of War Ragnarok trailer, mm, that was really good. I can't wait for God of War. But anyway, let's get back to what really matters. Sonic. That's what really matters. So, we're gonna react to this brand new Sonic Frontiers TGS trailer, Tokyo Game Show, if you don't know. We're gonna react to this and see what this is all about. So, by the thumbnail alone, you can probably just tell how good this is gonna be, alright? Let's get into it. Alright, here we are with the trailer, and with this said, let's go ahead and get into it. Going to press play on the mouse this time, not the space bar, unlike last time. The trailer! Let's go ahead and start it up. <laughs> Hi everyone, editing con here. Uh, for some reason, OBS did not capture the audio of the trailer when I recorded this. I'm not sure why, this has never happened before, but I didn't feel like having to just redo it, so that was kind of stupid. That would honestly be stupid to take the whole point away from doing a live reaction. So, I just put the trailer footage in kind of in the background of the video so hopefully it'll sync up perfectly if you notice it might seem like the sync up is a bit weird than the actual trailer um please note this is the reason why um yeah sorry about that i did not oh, was not aware of this entirely anyways i hope you all enjoyed the video all right let's do it oh I better turn it down a little bit oh you know the new sonic team logo that's cool oh this beautiful music i love it yo whoa whoa, whoa. that's a new island Okay, hold on. We're gonna be going looking at all this. Yo, this is a new. Uh, this is new. This is, that looks new. Oh, I'm probably getting copyrighted for this. Oh, this is new. Sirs. Oh, I love the way it sounds. Yo, was that a chaos ever? That animation looks so much better. It was Sonic. Was Sonic gliding on that? Oh, this is the cutscene that we saw before. Oh, it looks so much. It looks so good. Oh, I love the way it looks. Oh, this looks so good! This is... This game looks so good. Visually, it's stunning. No Sonic game's ever gonna beat it. Alright, we're climbing up the Titan. This must be the one that we heard about in the leaks. Oh, the color change. That was weird. Chaos Aeron. Sonic, what are you doing? He's back! Look at him! He's beautiful! Look at this serious guy! Oh, oh, we get to fight the Titan with the Super Sonic? Is that it? November 8th can't get here any faster. Oh, we're definitely all getting copyrighted for having vandalized in this video. <laughs> I'm just messing around. Alright, so, um, yeah. Oh, I'm about to check out everybody else's reactions later. But for now, um, this is a Sonic Team logo. Okay, I'm gonna mute it because we don't really need the sound. 
Um, okay, so that's the new Sonic Team logo. That looked really awesome. I like it. It has more style. It has a more. I like the new Sonic Team logo thing. It has more style, like more Sonic. Like in the previous um, games, like the past decade and stuff, it's always like I think maybe um, games like Nights into Dreams and the Adventure Games. May I don't. I'm not sure. I don't think the Adventure Games, but I do know games like um, Nights into Dreams had more of a stylish Sonic Team logo. Um, I'll put it right here. Sonic Team. Yeah, that looks, uh, it was more like a Sonic Team, Team Team, and it had like a ring sound effect, that was pretty awesome. But throughout, like, I think in Sonic Adventure and stuff, they just started having Sonic Team just fade in. Like, that was it. They just had it fade in with the Sonic, like, with the Sonic 1-Up logo, right there from Sonic Unleashed, and that was it. Like, it was literally just that. And it just faded away, there was no real style to it, and they actually kind of added a better style to it now, like, it's more... I don't know, something about, like, you know, you see, like, the rings and the Sonic, like, making, like, the head logo and, like, the colors. It just looks so much better, and I like that. Now, let's talk about this! This volcano ring right here. So, is this, like, a new island centered around a volcano? Like, kind of what I mentioned in my previous video, which you should all go watch. <laughs> um, is this on the Starfall Islands? I don't think it is. That's a cyberspace portal we're at here. Is this a, is it Starfall Islands? What I meant Kronos Island. Is this so? Is this Kronos Island? It doesn't look like it. I don't. Th I think this might be a new island because I don't think we've seen this before. This might be a new island. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see. All right, Sonic for Tears. That new logo looks sick. It looks so good. I prefer that so much. Okay, so here we have this boss that seems to spawn a bunch of other little guys. You know, th this reminds me of the one boss uh, from Sonic Heroes. It's that one. Um, Casino Rush or whatever in like Casino Park Zone, Eggman had like this boss where he like unleash all of these uh, enemies. Like you just pretty much be fighting a ton and a ton throughout the whole boss. Um, you, I'm pretty a lot of you Sonic Heroes fans, you might know what I'm talking about. It, it's kind of like that. It's, this, this is what it reminds me of. Yeah, this might be. This looks like, is this like a mini boss or I don't know what this is, but it looks really good. Here's the oh, this must be the rail um thing that we heard about. Okay, whoa, 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 so much is happening in this trailer. Dad gum. Okay, um, so. This must be the rail boss fight that we heard about earlier this month with the whole, um, like with it being, like, it's like a, it's like a little thing that transforms like to a big rail boss. Yeah, this must be it right here. This looks cool. Wait, are we like side looping around it? That's pretty interesting. Um, yeah, that looks pretty cool. Um, yeah, let's see what else. There. This also right here is, that's a chaos animal. That's, it looks like he's getting sucked out of Sonic or something. That looks interesting. Like, so I guess the enemy takes the chaos animal you have. It's purple. The one, the Titan had one earlier was purple as well. What's with the enemies in Sonic games using purple chaos emeralds? Like, Memphis used the purple chaos emerald. What is with that? Why, what is with enemies using purple chaos emerald? I'm not sure. That looks interesting. Alright, whoa. The camera looks a bit more zoomed in on Sonic there. Hmm. But I do, but if you haven't noticed, they fixed the animation for this where he's sideways now and doing kicks. Like, that's so much better. Okay, so here it was, it was Sonic um, using a, a paraglider like in Breath of the Wild. <laughs> Oh gosh, I swear. I, I mentioned this before, but if I see any, I better not hear a single Breath of the Wild comparison. Like, like I, people are going to compare this to Breath of the Wild in the reviews like IGN and GameSpot and stuff when it comes out in November. But I swear, it, th that's all I need to hear. I need to hear, you could definitely get the Breath of the Wild sense. Like, Breath of the Wild didn't invent grass, you know? Um, but still, though, like, this looks really good and interesting. Like, it honestly kind of reminds me of what was shown off in the Zelda trailer yesterday, kind of, of when the Link, like, just hop onto, like, one of those falling ruins or something. I can't remember what it was. I've seen the trailer once. But yeah, this looks, looks interesting. It's on the cloud area. It looks like it was on that same area where we saw the volcano. I think it's, this might be a new island. Master powerful abilities. Now, here's the cutscene. Oh, I've seen everybody talk about this online. Sonic's really expressive here, and I like this. Like, people say, oh, he was expressive like this in Forces. No, he wasn't. In Forces, he was, it was literally just like his, eye, his like, eyes moved up just by a little bit. But he, like, barely moved. Like, he's actually moving here. Like, it looks so much better. You can tell that there's definitely improved quality. Like, yes, it's a low bar, but it still just looks way better. Like, this, this has not been like, we've not seen stuff like this in a Sonic game at all, and this looks really good. The Titan looks really interesting with his teeth and whatnot. <laughs> Not sure how I feel about that, but we can, we can see Sonic right here climbing up the Titan. This is really good. We heard about this in the leaks in 2021. And here we see him grabbing the purple Chaos Emerald. Gets them all, and boom. Super Sonic. I miss Super Sonic so much. I'm not sure if y'all know this, but I grew up with Super Sonic um, when I was a kid. Like, I loved Super Sonic so much. Like, 
I, like, I had like a ton of plushies and action figures of Super Sonic. Like I used to go into the mall. I used to go into a mall of mine when I was a kid and just have my Super Sonic action figure. I just loved Super Sonic. I just loved his design. I loved. Heck, it's even the profile on my channel. I mean, I love Super Sonic. All right, what can I say? It's the profile on my channel. So, I just love. I just like Super Sonic all together. Like. Super forms is just something I've always loved in video games and anime and stuff like that. Like, I just love it. I just like just the way characters look and the powerful they get and just it's just so freaking awesome that Super Sonic is finally back. I, and what I just said earlier, that what I said earlier was literally my Sonic movie reaction. Like I, I exactly said that in the theater. Like my friend was sitting next to me, he was like, "What are you? Are you crying?" I'm like, "No, he's just so beautiful." Because we haven't seen Super Sonic back in like story wise in like. A decade like the last time supersonic was here story-wise was Sonic Unleashed and um, Generations if you want to get technical, but Unleashed is where it was really good at like Generations It was here because you know it was a celebration, but Unleashed is, is where it was really for the last time and I Gotta say just I love this so much like this. I don't know if I told you all this But I actually did place my pre-order for this game quite a while back actually well not a while back um, I think it was after, after, yes, after the overview trailer dropped, I did place my pre-order for this game on Amazon because I, as much as I like to get the steelbook, um, as you can tell, I have quite the video game collection behind me, like you can see back there, it's my PlayStation collection, PS4, PS5, Nintendo Switch, um, I like to keep it consistent, okay, like I don't have a single steelbook in my, uh, video game collection at all, now when it comes to movies, yes, I like steelbooks, but... I don't, I don't, but as, as cool as that Sonic Frontier Steelbook looked, I didn't get it, so I got the regular off of Amazon, because I've always had good times with Amazon, like Amazon uh, always get, whenever I pre-ordered a game on Amazon, they'd always get it to me on time, like Super Smash Bros. Ultimate, I pre-ordered that, they gave it to me, and just, yeah, I mean, I didn't have problems with uh, GameStop, but I pre-ordered Sonic Mania, uh, the collector's edition, I got it on launch, but still, um, it's still kind of just, I still trust Amazon more, so, yeah, but yeah, this looks really, really good, I'm so happy to see supersonic back like it's just so good like <sighs> I, I words can't describe how excited this makes me like do we get to play as supersonic though that's my question do we get to play as him do we get to you know run around the island as him? maybe after the game we get to but this is just so awesome like it's just so good to see him back like i just love seeing supersonic here just look how serious he is too like it just looks really good and here we see him dash into the Titans, so please don't let that be a cutscene. Please let us fight him. Please let us do moves, all right? Let us let us do something and beat up the Titan. Like, I just can't wait for this game so dead gum much. And yes, here it says pre-order now and receive the treasure box. I don't think I get it because I pre-ordered it physically. I pre-ordered it on my PS5, and I didn't pre-order it for my Switch uh, because uh, I want to have money. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't pre-order for PC because of Denuvo. So, we'll probably definitely be playing it on the PS5 when it comes out. Uh, we'll be streaming it then, so don't worry. Uh, but yeah, we'll be playing it on the PS5. And yeah, this trailer looks really good. I like, I love this trailer. It was really good. Like, it definitely showed off more stuff just, you know, to get us excited. Like, this marketing has improved so much. Th this game has had a complete 180, honestly. Like, it's insane how much this game has had a complete 180 of itself. And this logo, I gotta say, like, this logo looks sick. All right. You can tell Sega is doing something different, but they still need to prove it to us that yeah, this is definitely a new island. Wait, 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 hang on a second. Was that a, was that a was that a cannon? That's a dead go cannon. In a Sonic game? Okay, what is this game? What is this game? What is it? I honestly want to know. But this is definitely a new island. Like there's a volcano, lava right there. That lava looked beautiful. Like that looked really good. Like, this is, oh, it's so beautiful. I cannot wait to play this game. Like, I think I think this is the first time us Sonic fans have been, like, legit excited for a Sonic game. Like, we've been, like, looking forward to them, but this is the first time I think we're, like, all eager to play. And this is really good. Like, there's just so many reasons just for us to get excited. Like, this looks really good, okay? And this cutscene right here, it looks so beautiful, and I just love the way it looks and the way Sonic is animated, and just, you could tell there's been a step up, and, like, after, like, Sonic Forces, they said, hey, maybe we should do this thing called put a lot of effort into it. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, that was the trailer, and it looks really good, like I said. 
I love the way this game is turning out. Like I said, this game did a complete 180 of itself when it came to its marketing and everything it had to offer. Like, this is insane. So, again, another reason how IGN first should have never have happened. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, let me know in the comments. What did you think of this new trailer at Tokyo Game Show today? What do you think of Supersonic? Are you glad he's back? And what do you think overall of just the way this game is looking now? And have you placed a pre-order for it? Let me know in the comments. And if you're excited for this game, also let me know. And if you're not excited for this game, let me know. Let's all have a discussion in the comments. I love talking to you guys. So let's have a discussion. Why not? But anyways, if you enjoyed the video, make sure you leave a like. And also that'll help support the channel. And also make sure you subscribe. If you're not subscribed, we'd love to have you here. And also, if you don't want to miss any more Sonic content, make sure you subscribe once again. And also, hit the bell icon so you don't miss any more content so you can get notified whenever I post again. We do all sorts of things Sonic related here on this channel. We do reactions, we do updates, we do... Well, I'm not sure about updates because I haven't done updates in so long. <laughs> That's kind of false advertisement. <laughs> uh, we do reactions, I do reviews, um, I do whatever I can Sonic related. I give you all quality over quantity. So, And with that said, thank you all so much for watching. And until the next time, everybody, take care.